Hey everyone, it's Alex here, bringing you the latest scoop on Apple's highly anticipated iPhone 15. As you know, we're only a few days away from Apple's yearly event, September 12th. I think they're calling it Wonderlust. Thanks to many leaks, especially for Mark Gurman. Alright, first up, A17 CPU chip. And we could be looking at Apple's first ever 3 nanometer processor chip. So expect a 10 to 15% of boost in performance and a 30% reduction of power consumption, which is good. More battery life, right? Okay, next up, board size. Yes, board size. <laughs> Rumors suggest that we could be looking at a slim down from 2.2 millimeters to 1.5 millimeters. Here's a leak by Forbes Majin Boo iPhone 15 Pro leak screen protector shows super thin vessels. All right, next up. Finally, 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 USB-C. And this is largely attributed to the EU regulations. Apple might finally be parting ways with the lightning cable as it embraces the USB-C. So this could mean breakneck data and faster charging speeds. Early Intel suggests that we could be seeing a Thunderbolt 4 performance. So that's USB-C 4, which means um, the transfer speeds is gonna go from 480 megabytes per second, that's with the lightning cable, all the way up to 40,000 megabytes per second. But I honestly don't remember the last time I plugged my iPhone to my MacBook Pro to transfer anything. It's been a long time. But with those transfer speeds, who knows? I might think about it. I'm also really excited about the faster charging speeds along with using the same type of cable that my Nikon Z uses, my GoPro, my iPad Pro, my MacBook Pro. <laughs> Next is Wi-Fi 6E. So the iPhone 15 is rumored to have the Wi-Fi 6E which boasts speeds of up to 1.7 gigabytes per second. Now that's more than double the speed of the Wi-Fi 6 which boasts around, let me see, 730 megabytes per second. All right, next up. According to Bloomberg's Mark Gurman, the titanium finish will be replacing the stainless steel, which will help reduce the weight. And last but not least, rumors suggest that the Dynamic Island, Dynamic Island, Dynamic Island, will be in all the lineup and not just in the pro models. All right, next up is new zoom lens. And uh, Mac rumors has confirmed from the industry sources, iPhone 15 Pro Max will be equipped with a new periscopic zoom lens. Zoom lens capable of delivering a staggering 6X and even all the way up to 10X optical zoom. All right, now that we've covered all the rumored specs, let's talk about what's on my wish list, specifically for the Pro lineup. It's a front-facing camera with more megapixels, a wider field of view. Imagine not having to stick out your hands all the way out, take that group selfie. Okay, so those are the features on my wish list for the iPhone 15 Pro. How about you? What's on your wish list? Let me know below the comments. Till next time. Don't forget to subscribe.